Uganda is making inroads into other African markets through its milk value chain. And as a result, some African countries want to glean a few lessons on how Uganda has been able to multiply its milk production over the last three decades. Speaking about the ongoing African Dairy Conference in Kampala, the dairy sector player says paperwork relating to export of Uganda's powdered milk has reached its tail end pending exportation due next month. Of course, we are embracing the African continental free trade area, and uh, in that regard, uh, the bilateral agreement was signed uh, between the government of Uganda and the government of Algeria to export powdered milk in excess of uh, 500 million US dollars worth. We've been working with the, the three companies that currently have the capacity to, to process and export powdered milk. As a way of uh, uh, fulfilling the requirements to export, uh, these companies have bidded and uh, the bidding process is being concluded this month. So the only way to trade, uh, to survive as African countries is to trade among ourselves. Because we have areas of scarcity and areas of printing. And we must provide a mechanism for moving uh, products, not only dairy products alone, but equally coffee, equally tea, equally maize, because in some areas they are not producing. So we need to open our borders, and uh, it's uh, really uh, something that is begging. And uh, in my opinion, it is a political question. The 16th African Dairy Conference is looking at building and consolidating continental dairy value chain while riding on the back of the African free trade area. Ismail Musa, Ladu, NTV Business.